Okay. So how do we do this one? So they're saying the words difference quotient. What difference quotient means, let me write it over here. Difference quotient is this, f of x plus h minus f of x all over h. That big ugly thing that we've been, we've been doing a few times, that is called the difference quotient. Why is it called that? It's a difference on the top, a subtraction, difference, and the whole thing is a division, which is what the word quotient means. I don't know if you know, quotient means fraction or division. So it's a, it's a subtraction fraction. In other words, a difference quotient. It's a subtraction fraction, difference quotient. So uh, that's what they mean when they say the difference quotient, something used a lot in calculus. That's what they're getting us ready for. All right, so what, what do we gotta do? We gotta do all those parts one at a time. Let me start with this part right here. So I'm gonna do them one at a time. I've gotta do f of x plus h. So that means take the function right here and plug in x plus h. So it'll become, so the function is six blank plus h and I'm gonna plug in x plus h. So in the place of what I did, if that's confusing, let me, let me write the function up here again. Let me bring it down actually better f of x, the function, is 6 blank plus 8. Remember that x is a blank. And what it means is whatever you put in the parentheses, plug it into the blank. Plug it in where x was. x is just holding a spot. It's a blank. It's like the holes in a toaster. So when they say f of x plus h, I plug x plus h into that blank. Okay and then work it out. So what do I get here? F of x whoops, plus h equals, and then distribute this, 6x plus 6h plus 8. Great, okay, so that's f of x plus h. Now we can go back to the difference quotient. Difference quotient will equal, first off, f of x plus h. What's f of x plus h? Well, I just did it right here. It is 6x plus, oops, 6h plus 8, and then minus f of x. What's f of x? Well, f of x is the original function given right here. 6x plus 8 all over h. So, so far, I have done what they wanted. They said, find f of x plus h. I did. And put it here first. So here's, here's f of x plus h. All right, so everybody see that? This here is f of x plus h. And this here is f of x. So that is f of x plus h minus f of x all over h. And now we just have to work that thing out. You know what the deal is, anything in, um, with drop, drop the parentheses and if there is anything in the front, it'll distribute. There's nothing in front of the first parentheses. Second parentheses, the minus sign is gonna go there and there. So the might become minus six X minus eight. All over H. Like that. And so that'll equal well, the 6x and 6x will cancel, the 8 and the 8 will cancel, 6h over h, the h is cancel, 6. The answer to all that is just 6. So that is what they mean when they say find the difference quotient. It means, it means this, the, this subtraction fraction right up here, this subtraction fraction, difference 
quotient f of x plus h minus f of x all over h and it all simplifies down on that one to just be six.